What is this room? Nothing, but what is in the next room? I could vaguely see the queen through the glass. I had to be careful. I didn't want to trespass. So the queen is in here, huh? Time to drill. Amrita could see me and that would be bad. I didn't want to do something that made her mad. Very well. It's curious that she doesn't really imprison people. I mean, there's no prison section. I could just, uh, she left me there and I could just roam around. Ooh, a kitchen. What's cooking? A bland smell coming from the stew. Maybe it needed something fresh and new. The chef looked like he was swearing. <laughs> Said Gordon Ramsay, what dish are you preparing? A veggie stew for the celebration. But for me, this is only frustration. We ran out of spice a long time ago, so everything tastes bland, you know? All I got are these tasteless roots. Oh, how I long for some fresh fruits. If this meal disappoints the queen, she'll retire me if you know what I mean. That knife looks sharp. Do you have another? Maybe I could borrow one if it's uh, no bother. Sorry, miss. I need my blade to cut these roots, I'm afraid. But if you could get me something tasty for the stew, something fresh, I could probably lend it to you. Mm, I haven't seen any food around. Okay, so I have to get the chef some uh, spicy spices. On the chef's table, propped vegetables finely chopped. Cool. I only saw some leaves on the holy place. Can I take those? A piece of fruit was lying there rotten. Maybe a sacrifice, maybe just forgotten. Is that- oh, that is- that is enough spice. It looks like a chili. That's gonna heat things up a bit. The fruit was old and musty. Unedible, moist and dusty. Perfect. <laughs> Just what the queen deserves. I can't serve the queen fruit that is rotten. She would surely kill me. Have you forgotten? Right, I need to make it young again. Can it revive dead things? I mean, this fruit is obviously n not alive. Not, not great anymore. So what if a person dies? Can they be revived? But don't I need to put something in return? Yeah, this won't work. Maybe if I- st on that stage, things would age. What if I age the drill? I shrugged my shoulder. That didn't need to get older. Hmm, so I need something that would get older so I can revive the Peppa. This machine left me vexed. Could swap time from one thing to the next. Next. The stairway looked battered. The slope had shattered. Can I go up this slope? Why don't, why don't I just use myself? It's only a little bit a chunk of my life to revive this pepper. This was the part I understood least. Inside that circle, time decreased. I'm just gonna leave that there because it's in the right position. There were some ladies there that I didn't notice. Hello, ladies. Hello there, ladies. She talks just like me. <laughs> How do you do? My name is Ruth. Nice to meet you. You hear that, Titi? Her name is Titi. Titi? She called you a lady. You don't deserve that title. You're so shady. Tihihi. Aw. But Salva, you're no better. Remember that mechanic? He fled your bedroom naked in panic. They're the sweetest. So are you in charge of the decorations? They look nice. Congratulations. It's a secret, but I'll spoil it. We drag the garlands through the toilet. You're the best. You see, we don't like the queen very much. She's unstable and uses the staff as a crutch. Before I take my cows back to my farm, I'll stop her so she can do no more harm. That's the spirit. I wish I was your age. Ah, uh, when my breasts weren't below my ribcage. 
all of them. They're just, just so sweet. But seriously, we wish you the best of luck. Tell the queen she's a stupid lame duck. I will. Oh, it's dark in here. Is this where I came in from? Yeah. A metal sheet fastened by screws. Ha ha. Do it. I took the metal plate. It was quite lightweight. Needed that, apparently. It was a metal plate quite lightweight. There was a hollow channel hidden beneath the panel that I could slip in. Woohoo! Wow, it's dark in here. The tunnel was narrow and tight. The darkness gave me fright. Yeah, I could feel the chute split. Should I continue or should I quit? Oh boy. I hope uh, there's no deaths in this game. I can't save. <laughs> mm, okay, I'm gonna get lost in here, so eh, was, we might as well just uh, go up. Oh, that's where I needed the map. I had come to a dead end. My crawling adventures I'd have to suspend. Right, I needed the map from that mechanic. Because I'm going to the ventilation shafts. So since we can't go up, let's go down. We'll figure out a way out of this town. Help. Send help. What was I doing in this dark mage? Mage maze. Again, the shaft split in two ways. Let's go up. Again, I could feel the tunnel split. Should I go up, down, or quit? We're not quitting. Ah, okay. So it's just, it's a little bit of trial and error if you don't want to go back and shoot a picture of the of the map like I should have. Let's try again with the map in front. So, so I see. So we go down, and then up. At least that part I got right. I think we need to go up. Because down, I think, is um, almost certain death. It would take us to that place with the uh, floating piece of fire. Let's go up and see where it takes us. I can see some tree symbols. Just as my heart filled with dread, I saw a sliver of light ahead. Hey, Queenie. I think I need to get your staff. The Queen sat there, quite relaxed, while her people were dying, taxed. Bitch. From the chute, I could see a plate of fruit and a bottle of brute. Nice. So I need to get her food. Amrita's staff was directly below, stuck in a hole emitting a blue glow. A beautiful wooden drawer sat in the corner on the floor. It looked like the queen lived quite well, while she kept her people in conditions like hell. Irk, that didn't work. It was impossible to throw anything from inside. The slits were narrow. I would miss if I tried. I need to get rid of her somehow. Yeah, there's not much I can do from here. Yeah, I may, I may have come in a little early. It lined up with my expectations. It seemed Amrita kept gloomy decorations. Indeed. Where did I go? Come back. Ruth, come back here, girl. <laughs> well, there's not much I can do, so let's go back. There was nothing down that way. I decided I should stay. Alrighty. 
What's a this away? Actually, I think I've explored just about everything. This was the Queen's chamber, wasn't it? Oh no, I haven't been here. It was one of those huge salt pillars. Maybe they were just maybe they were just used by some distillers. Can I get some? I couldn't drill through rock. Anyway, I didn't need salt from this block. Well, don't you think it would help that guy's brew stew brew thing? Cogs were slowly revolving, like my brain when puzzle solving. Exactly. It's exactly what our brain looks looks like. It was a red sign with a pillar and a circle design. And a red button. Push. Put your hand in there. It was closed before. Now as if it was an open door. Put this in. I didn't want to put that that there. Maybe it was needed somewhere else. I ruined the rhyme. <laughs> Looking down on Earth, my awe grew. Such a beautiful planet, so brilliantly blue. But before my return, I would offer my assistance to this to these poor people and their hopeless resistance. Damn straight. Alright. I don't know what to do with this, so let's go back and talk to some people. I think I'll go talk to um to that boy. And his mom and to this. Actually, what's up here? This one isn't this one's fine. Macaus! I forgot about this place. How are you guys doing? You okay? I'm gonna get, get you out of here. After what they've been through, it, it was quite amazing that they all were quietly and happily grazing. Ah, so ignorant, but so cute. Please, there must be some way that you can save my cows today. My hands are bound, I'm afraid. And Rita holds the power and can't be swayed. And even if I were to be trying. Our holy herd is still dying. What is wrong with the beast over there? Her horn is broken and her breath irregular. That is Yogita. She is the wild one of the herd. Last time in the age machine, something occurred. She went berserk and her tail flung, almost like she didn't want to get young. Now we must tie her down to make her stay, and feed her sleepy grass to keep her at bay. Oh, she just wants to die. I took some yellow plants and stuck them down my pants. Well, that's that's what all characters use their pants for. Inventory space. Poor thing. The milk beast was sleeping with a snoring sound. With a rope around her horn, she was bound. Poor thing, but I think uh, I, I know how we'll repair her horn. There was a huge cavity below the rock that defied gravity. What is this green thing? I saw ya. Squeak. That was far from weak. Of course. A hey, froggy, please wait. I won't put you on a plate. The frog was far quicker than me. When I bent down, it wanted to flee. It's scaring the cows. <laughs> oh, thank you! Luca, with her wonderful physique, had caught the frog. Had caught the frog that went squeak. What would I do without you? Indeed, what would we do without Luca? The frog with the squeak so violent sat still in my hand, silent. Some buds I found on the lawn, smelling them made me yawn. So I have sleepy, sleepy grass. That should help with things. It was nothing like, like home, this huge, strange dome. So I'm gonna drug someone. How do I get out of here? Okay, good. I'm gonna drug someone and rudely awaken someone with the squeaking frog. Ladies, do you have any suggestions? Come on. Come on, tell me. No, nope, you're just snickering a little bit. Well, that's fine. You keep being you, ladies. So where should I go? I still need to make that pepper young. Oh, 
I should go back to the medical ward and then talk to Vic. This. Although I like the name Vic more. Hey buddy, how's she doing? No, oh, still, still not great. Still dying. What's up? What happened? I didn't need to inspect. That machine was wrecked. What happened, buddy? Are you alright? Asked the man, a poor sight. Oh my stars, thank you, Ruth. But things are not good to tell you the truth. I was trying to make a brew for the feast when something happened and the pressure increased. Suddenly the brewing machines exploded. They're old and the pipes had probably corroded. Everything is lost. The queen will be so crossed. This has to stop. We have to contravene. I just need to know how, to, how I can stop the queen. Steal the staff. It contains the power. But don't get caught. It will be your final hour. Here, let me help you on... Here, here, let me help you to your feet. Before I show the queen her defeat. Just let an old man sit and rest. Go get the staff. Do your best. You got back... You got back your youth? Good on you, Ruth. Yeah. I'm young again. How's the repair going? Is there any progress showing? Well, the engine is soon due. Is soon done. But the hood fell off though on the last run. Hey, I've got something for it. The hover sled needs a new bonnet. Don't worry, I'm on it. Can I borrow your oil can? I asked the old man. It's almost empty, a sad state of affairs. I need it for oiling and squeaky repairs. How about this? This was into technology, not toads and biology. How about this? This is good. I can use this as a hood. A few more adjustments and she's ready to fly. Now I just need a pilot who's not afraid to try. Um, now that the hood is firmly affixed, I believe the hover sled is fixed. Um, pilot Ruth, experienced milkmaid of the Milky Way, reporting for duty. So I can't borrow your your oil gun? Hmm. I need it for some reason. I really, really need